Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games, and it's after dark. It is after dark. Somewhere. Ooh. Not here. No, it's quite quite uh, sunny and warm here, actually. Four in the afternoon. It's quite warm. Cats. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's normal time for cats to have their lunch. Oh, did you feed them? But they got double breakfast. That's true. They did get double breakfast. And they're going to get treats, I'm sure. He's meowing his head off. <laughs> Just sit, <laughs> sitting and meowing. He's meow. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Meow. Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew. Hello. We're going to be playing today. We're going to try for some high scores. Where's, where's the box? What? It's right here. What? Oh. Okay. What, 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 what? We're going to play playing Gorf oh. Arcade. Uh, last yes. time we got, well, I got. Um, you and Darcy played, right? Uh, no. Oh, Corey. Corey. Oh, okay. I think. Yeah, yeah. Uh, me and Corey. Corey was here. Um, and I got the first patch on Garf Arcade, and I started playing the next level. And I did pretty well, so I think I'll be able to get the second patch. Can you change that to dark mode, please? Mm. And uh, maybe we'll try it for the third patch, depending how well the second patch goes. Um, awesome game. If you've never played it, uh, definitely pick it up right now, because mm -hmm. it will be whoo, gone for a little bit at least. Be gone in uh, a week. Oh no. A week. You have oh, no. a week left to get this. So oh, no. if you don't already have it and you do want it, head over to Atari Age store because that's where you need to get it right now. Oh yeah, we're playing Atari 2600 games today. At least for now. Um, where's my schedule? I want to thank all the Twitch subscribers mm -hmm. who help support the show. Scrolling past Tanya Where's there. Tanya? Uh, Al Defer, Arkham H7, Arb Scar Coder, Atari 1974, Atari, Beef Supreme, Beer Pokop, Charles Donny Mal, Charles Williams, Chitlala, Colonel Lamb, Dan, if you see Daryl 1970, Dr. Moo Cows, Gamma Dev, Glenn Main, Gray Defender, Gretams, Ground Trooper, Johnny WC, Carol G, Ken Jennings, Invader, Kveltifer, Lambda Express, Lone DTZ, Mark Yannis, Mark Spacing, Mick Muse, Mike Soul, Michael Down, Mother 3, Mr. Zarno with Mr. Fix, Mighty Funster, Nathan Strum, Neo Media, Nostalgic, Quahog, RC70, Rendered Ghost Apprentice, VG, Carter Pim, Six Weeks, Sledgehammer, Smitty B, Spicer, S. Mirrors, Teleprompter, D Train, Tiki Dan Key, D Dan K, uh, not key. A uh, track M D. Uh, Vexer X, a new name. Nice. And X Ken X. And just before the show, Charles Wheel and Neo Media subscribe. Thank you so much. Yay, thank you. Uh, even while we're on break, people are supporting us. Yes. Uh, it feels like we've been off for a month, <laughs> but we've only <laughs> like been off week. for two weeks. And then you still played with Corey. We still play. Yeah, because yeah, we can't not play. Yeah. Uh, just not official shows. Yeah. Hey, nostalgic. Hey. And welcome to everybody in the chat. Hey, Andrew Davey. Um, um, we don't have a unboxing to do, but uh, on Tuesday we will. When we return to regular show, we have uh, this box. <laughs> and we have this box. He's just teasing the boxes. I we am. will eventually open. Yeah, on Tuesday <laughs> we'll open them. Uh, they're very both very... <laughs> Very exciting. Very exciting. I'm really excited to open those boxes. There's also another thing we're unveiling. Are we unveiling that on Tuesday yes, as well? Yes, all of it oh, on there's Tuesday. there's so much exciting stuff coming And we have two world premieres on Tuesday we for really? the 2600. So nice. it's going to be a big show. Nice. Always like to have return big, right? Yeah. If you take a break, you got to have something to bring people back. So Yeah, and we would have yeah. done more shows in the break, like After Dark shows. But we've been fairly sick. We've been very sick, actually. Both of us. I got it first, then passed it to Tanya. Yes. Oh. Where did I get it from? Oh, Some concert? Uh, no, I think it oh, was VRGE, Vancouver actually. Vancouver Retro Gaming yeah. Expo. Bunch of <laughs> That's sick, what I blame. Sick people there or something. It was yeah. like packed wall-to-wall -wall people. No one was wearing masks because no one yeah. does anymore. Oh, so yeah. I, I just kind of figured we probably picked it up from some... Somebody going somebody <coughs> in, my in that face. room. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, US, it, US Border Customs was very excited about this package yep. too. They were like, oh, what's in there? And yeah. they wanted to find out early. Yeah. Bastards. So they know yep. what's in it. <laughs> so yeah, they got a sneak peek. Yeah. Yeah. Double down. Do? Double down. Uh, yeah. You saw me post on. Uh, oh, yeah. I posted everywhere. It's just yeah. funny. Yeah. I, I rarely get customs opening my boxes. No, but but, I, but they were like, oh, this I one's cool. I think they cool. scan things and they probably they are like, see. that's weird, and they want to open and see what it is. Yeah, if I, they're I not assume. really sure, maybe what's yeah. in it. Yeah, I, that and, that wouldn't surprise me. And video game stuff has a lot of wires and things, so they're like, oh, let's just take a yeah. They can tell look. it's electronics, but not yeah. exactly what it is. So no, they're yeah. not familiar I, I get with it. I get 
I get it. Retro stuff, maybe. There's a cat wrapped in bubble, bubble wrap, wrap over there. He's very cute. <laughs> He's so cute. He should funny. be on camera over here. Yeah. Come here. Mm. Come here. Um, we do have some news. I just didn't want to wait till Tuesday because mm. um, it's, it's kind of timely. Not really. One of them is. Um, so this one. Um, um, so we're we're talking about Gorf Arcade leaving the Atari Age store. Mm -hmm. So this is this is kind of um, part of it. Uh, so this was a post about Mappy, and it was it was uh, reviewed on the video game critic. It got an A. Oh, another game of his got an A plus. Wow. Um, very few games get A pluses. Yeah, it's very harsh on games. <laughs> like Galagon didn't get an A plus. Mm. What? What? Um, but um, this was a response um, to a Casey Nidal. Nidal. Um, uh, I'm gonna buy a few more of your complete box games when I get a when I still can, I need to buy some, buy the ROMs for the games I get, phys I still need to buy the ROMs for the games I get physical copies, because you can get both. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, John replied, thanks for the support, we are currently seeking alternative publishing options. Oh, uh, okay. So hopefully some of these games can see a physical release in the future. Uh, so they're looking for another way to get them on cart in nice. the box. So that's nice. excellent. So Good. we may see... Uh, the Champ Games line of games returning Good. Um, to physical uh, boxes. So Excellent. stay tuned for that, I guess. And we'll mm -hmm. see see where that uh, ends up. Um, and this was posted yesterday as well uh, by Albert in the Atari forums. Uh, wanted! 7800 consoles! Oh. I'm going to have several new 7800 games at this year's Portland Retro Gaming Expo as, lo as well as a larger Atari age booth. Because mm -hmm. he got... I mean, it wasn't small. He always no. has a big one, but it wasn't as big as previous years, and it was stuck way in the back. It, it was strange. also right near the loading the bay. The loading bay, and was, he couldn't. It was such a pain to set it up early, and it was yeah. Because we were setting it up with him, and it was a pain because they kept unloading things through, so we couldn't set yeah. up the tables in yeah. the way. Yeah. Oh my god. Anyway, hopefully it's moved out of the way That's of the loading been bay. This year, yeah. But he's getting a bigger booth, and there's going to be. And he says, "I'd like to have more seven eight hundred systems set up at this year's show." Not just for all the new games, but also for some games in progress, mm. as well as some older 7800 games. So he really wants to feature the 7800 games because there's so many good ones now. Mm -hmm. um, to that end, I'm looking to buy more 7800 uh, consoles. Okay. So if you have one or more working 7800 consoles you can sell me, please send me a PM and let me know how much you're asking. Hopefully we can work out a deal. Thank you and take care. So if you have any 7800 consoles, like you have a fourth or Hex fifth friends. one. I know you need three, but if you have a fourth or fifth one, <laughs> um, and he's not looking to borrow them because people <coughs> have asked. Okay. Um, not Hoser. No. <laughs> um, have asked if he wants to borrow them. No, he wants he wants them permanently so he can keep yeah. using them for not just PRG, but for other, because he's posted elsewhere about this, mm -hmm. um, for other conventions. Um, and I'm guessing he's going to get them modded as well for um s video at least yeah so if you have any extra 7 800s i know i only have one or two backups yeah so <laughs> i i have none to spare at the moment no i think i only have one extra one you just have maybe two, two. no i have one loose and one in the box up there okay so like i said if you have a fourth or fifth one <laughs> i only have three so i have none to spare <laughs> yeah silly um so there you go uh, just get in touch with uh al if you have any yep. uh, extra ones so we're going to be playing gorf today mm -hmm. trying for the second patch yep. i got the first patch i don't physically have it yet because i don't want him sending one at a time fair enough um but he's he has four patches available for a this lot game of patches yeah first one is challenging yeah not impossible second one's hard third one's very hard fourth one is near impossible, impossible. yeah but uh, not impossible because someone has it. Someone just got it. Oh, Joseph Yanoski just got it. Wow. And he left 21,000. And he left a message on um, our uh, playthrough of for the first patch. Oh, OK. Uh, for me, encouraging me. Yeah. And he said, uh, it was by Triple J two six five three two. Uh, I'm glad to have these two incredible ports, both Gorf Arcade and Load Runner, because played Load Runner as well and got yeah. through some more levels. 
uh, for the 2600 really do excel in your own, own merits. Congratulations on achieving Space Warrior patch, James. As uh, uh, Stephen Ramirez said, best about Gorf Arcade is best to practice shooting at the enemies and knowing the strategy for each stage and how it works. Yeah. Playing Gorf enough times to earn these patches did work out for me, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, to the point of being the first to achieve Space Champion on Challenge Mode. No hard feelings, Steve. I believe you can pull it off, too. <laughs> He said that, I mean, yeah. uh, it may sound crazy, but it's true. The thing with challenge mode on Gorf Arcade, not only you have more enemies <coughs> to deal with, yeah. but to fully execute your shots, especially when you get to space warp, where you have to shoot down every, every number of enemies shown in the mm -hmm. middle to advance while avoiding enemy fire as your ship is being pulled into the center. So there's gravity on that one where they're going around oh, yeah, in a circle. Yeah. Yeah. And the normal ones, there's no gravity. Yeah. Oh boy. I did find the flagship stage the most easy. I find that as well. It's 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 not very like you're not in danger as much as the other yeah. levels. Yeah. Uh and space warp the most difficult. I find I it hate as well. Space warp, yeah. Um very difficult. Yeah. Uh, Even on like the first round, it's, yeah. I find it very When playing through challenging. challenge mode, I will root for you guys to achieve these patches next time you play Gorf Arcade, which yeah. is today. Yeah. Yeah, somebody earned Space Champion. Yeah. Uh it that's that's incredible it is really hard mm. and not only do you have to you have to make it up to level he made it to 53 and you have to make it to level 51 oh wow on uh space champion for the first what's the first one? First one is space warrior and you have to make it to mission 21, 21. okay uh on the easy level so the one we're going for today is space Two? avenger okay second patch we have to make it to mission 26, 26. okay which is actually the same number of levels as the first patch the first patch the first five don't count they're practice mode okay so you have to do the same number um as from here is the top he made it to level 96 wow um so i think we can make this today there's six out of 20 six out of a 200 claimed patches so lots okay. of patches available still um and six also probably the same people um no, different people. Um, and then uh, Space Master, you have to make a mission mission 36 gotcha. on the advanced skill level. Advanced. So you have to do more levels on a, on a higher, higher skill level. level. Um, and and there's five out of 200. So I, I think I can, with enough practice, get this patch. Okay. On Space advanced. Champion? Cool. Maybe, but I really doubt it because you have to get it to mission 51. On challenge. On challenge skill level. Wow. And that's beyond arcade level. Yeah. That's harder than arcade because mm -hmm. there's things he's added in. The laser stage can be pretty tough. That's, I think I find the laser stage the hardest one because there's two lasers mm. that are shooting down plus things are diving at you. Yeah. Super, super hard. I don't hard. like the spinny one, the warp one. That's very hard I as have well. a hard time with that one. That, that one I find the hardest, I think. Yeah, especially yeah. when they start shooting at you. Oh. That's that's what really does it. Yeah. Uh, okay, so let's uh, let's dive into it, and I do have some uh, hints that we can kind of read out. I don't know okay. how good they'll be, but we'll uh, give it a try. I'll get let you go first. Oh well. Warm myself up. Warm the system up. Yep. Warm it up. Ready. Long live North. <laughs> exactly. So cute. Very, very cute. Challenge. Now we're going to be doing standard. Standard. So you yeah. might as well. And then advanced is level three. Yeah. Is, is patch three. I mean. Yeah. yeah. Patch three. So there's four levels. Four. Levels. <laughs> check. Check. Okay. So let me read out each of the hints as we get through the levels. I don't know if they're just like, shoot the enemies, watch out for their bullets. It's like, you know. <laughs> Stage one, Astro Battle. The first mission is nearly a straight clone of Space Invaders. This is the only mission set against a blue sky background instead of in space. You are protected by a glittering parabolic force field, which is gradually worn away by enemy projectiles. Uh, the force field 
also works in both directions, is therefore must momentarily deactivate in order to get the player ship to fire out. To advance the next mission, the player must destroy all the invaders. That's just a description, not really a hint. Um, fire immediately when the mission starts. You may get lucky and hit the Gorfian robot, disturbing the space invaders. Also fire at the invaders that are oh, just blasting through these levels. Uh, let me just skip to the... Galaxians oh here. Try to shoot the Galaxians as they're setting up to s yeah. get the score for attacking the Galaxian. At first, only a couple will come down. After a while, though, Galaxians attempt to swarm all over your ship. Since they each fire three shots apiece, they can, this could present a particularly deadly situation. Keep moving. There's no safe space. No, there isn't. Not even in the corners. At later ranks, it isn't uncommon for the whole bunch of Galaxians to attack your ship at once. Uh, if you can, try to hit the Gorfian robot that sometimes bounds over the top. So these are terrible. They're, they're basically what I said. Shoot. Yeah. Remember, you can move up and down. Oh, yeah, I Dodge always forget out. that. I, I also hate this one shot at a time because I keep pulling my shots. Well, it's better than waiting for it to go off the screen, and then you get it back. Because you can fire again if you need to. So it's the best. Oh, thank you, Nostalgic. It was, it was a bit loud to begin with. I did turn it down. Oh! I, I killed him, him and he killed you I with this him. explosion. I and we can move up and out of the way. I know, but it's just. God. My hint on this one is fire when they're small in the middle. Because well, yeah. they don't move as much. You're pulling your shots way too much. I know, I know. That's always my issue with this game. Is you get one bullet at a time. There you go. See, that's... that's. Uh, yeah. Dead. Dead. <laughs> D-E-A-D. -E -D, dead. My turn. Game audio is loud, someone was saying? Oh, better now. Okay. Yep. <laughs> no, we're not trying an easier game. <laughs> Got it. Just at the end. Oh, we're not trying for points, so it it's it's just matter. number of missions, right? I think you get you do get extra lives, but I, I it's not in the manual. Oh, how frequently? Yeah. So in the in the Champ Games manual, anyway. So I might have to look online. Not that it matters, because I'm mostly going for levels, and you'll just get points anyway with the with the levels as they progress. This one, I go for the laser guys as quickly as oh, possible. Oh, they are annoying. Because they really get in your way. They block the screen, right? They block your movement. So. Yeah. That's my hint. Ooh, that might be my... Amazon! Oh. Haha! -ha! I'll be right back. Okay. This one, I get the uh, yellow ships because they um, they come down in packs. And come out in this. Then they're all individuals. I don't know if it's better to get them when they're in packs, because then they stay together rather than split up. I'm not sure. Oh God. There's four coming down. I don't think it really matters. This is the one that I, I do the worst on for sure. Well, it's their bullets that really get me. Well, it's sure. their movement. I just, I'm just not tuned into their movement to kind of make sure I my shot hits. Also, I should stay at the bottom as much as possible. Well, well, yeah. Because um, their Gives bullets more come time. really fast and really the bullets quick. slow down as they get closer to you. So mm. if you're up top, you don't have much reaction time. This one just clear a bit of like the, the shield, so you have a, like a, a good area, and then just fire away. 
Oh my god, I'm way too high up. That was terrible. Terrible waste of a ship. It's okay. Gotta run yourself back up. Get yeah. yourself back into it. You just stay lower get on this the, one. Get too. used to the patterns again. Ooh, that, Ooh, was, that close. was very close. Not have much room. It's like a pixel wide. Uh. That's all you get is one pixel wide. Almost. It's easier to shoot when you are higher up, but it's so dangerous. I'm just tempted to go higher. Up. Damn it! Stupid! It's like level five. Oh, yeah, yeah, now he's wide open. There you go. Explosion! <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah. yeah. You'll hear Tanya coughing about it. I feel like it's... I it's... probably won't cough, but I might. Yay! Yay, five levels. Really, that just speeds up the game when you shoot Because he just spits them out really fast after you shoot them. So it's kind of an advantage. Yeah, I'm in the... Uh over the cold, but it's just that last little bit of, like, clearing yourself out. <laughs> yeah. I'm... You're pretty much Very, done. very at the end of the Yeah. Day. It's like once a day or twice a day. I and it's funny call. how you get sick and then suddenly everyone is sick. Like, everyone gets it at once. Well, yeah. Yeah. Well, you hope you don't pass it to the other people. Well, exactly, yeah. But, you know, you get Friends and <laughs> colleagues, but... Yeah, yeah my sister them. said, oh, I think I got what you wanted. But for like a day. I don't think that was the same thing. I think she was. This, was this is a two week thing. Like, I had um, a bit of a fever. Yeah. Small, minor, minor. So, this was actually the flu. Yeah. Like a real flu. Yeah. Convention crud is always a downer, says so nostalgic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What you're gonna do? Put a few thousand people in a enclosed space for all, several hours. All uh, vying to look at the same game. You yeah, are. all all leaning over the same console that. Uh, touching everything. Yeah. <laughs> touching their faces, touching <laughs> the stuff. Touching the faces again. Yeah. <laughs> Ew. Filthy. Yeah. Filthy humans. Very filthy. So PRG's coming up. Yay! Not soon, but soon. Oh, it's coming. <laughs> we booked our uh, hotels and everything. Yep. So got the tickets, booked got the hotels. Got everything kind of settled, so that's good. And I'm able to, we're able to stay for the full length this time. Yes. Finally, after Not many years. Not rushing back. I think oh last God. year and the, the last Every. one before that, too, I think we Every had to time. rush back. Every time. Yeah. So annoying. No, no immediate need to get back So we can help set up again. Be nice. Set up the Atari Age booth. Mm. And Champ Games will have their own booth as well. Cool. Which is very cool, so I don't know who needs help as well. Probably, probably a little bit smaller. Oof. And Paul? Yep. Yeah. Oh, no, he disappeared. I thought he was going to do one more pass. Oh, oh I didn't see that no. one. Ooh, not a good start. Oh, it's Come on. Just, just getting started. Yeah, practice, practice level. Technically, in this level, you don't have to fire a shot. Because they will do their round, around, around, mm, and they'll just disappear. Charles Whelan says, I think the Galaxian stage is about as tough as the Space Warp one. I, I, the Galaxian one, they do come at you really fast with a lot of shots. Yeah, um, they do. And it, it ramps up. I'm just not a big fan of the circular spinning and trying to dodge. Yeah, their projectile and try to hit them at the same time. As I find that quite challenging. The but ships yeah, the circling Galaxian themselves, one. I don't have too much of a problem with. It's their bullets that really get me. I really need to play more defensively. This game. Um, mm. Like watching for the bullets, not concentrating as much on firing and killing. Because going for many levels, you you have to conserve your lives. You know, just be able to... there we go. Or Charles Wheeler says, or maybe I just suck at both. No, they're hard. They're hard. <laughs> they're, they're hard. hard. Uh, 
Absolutely. Space Colonel! Space Colonel! So that means I've gone through three times? Two times. Two times. One level three. So that's ten. Ten out of twenty-six. Oh, oh, I think you get an extra life every round. I think you do. I think That's you get one more every round. So points really don't matter in this game unless you are trying to get a high score. I mean, that's a legitimate thing to go for. Points? D yeah, maximize oh, the yeah. points on each level. But sure. um, the but missions, that, it's hard to... But I'm going for the some, patch, which, which is does missions. not rely on score at all. Yeah. Got the lasers right away. Hi, oh my kitty. god, they're all diving. Oh, they're yeah. diving. Crazy. Look at them all! Harder, all of them! They're harder. not even stopping. Makes it a little bit easier to shoot because they're all in your face. Yeah, I don't really have a problem with that level. This one's, a, I think, a little bit harder than that one. Yes. So, if you want to know, these cats are master manipulators. Yep. And you had gotten up really early. Yeah. And um, in the morning, and they were whining away and so you and I, fed them because i didn't want them to whine for two hours while we we're trying to sleep <laughs> and then you went back to bed and then i got up and he didn't hear me get up and i fed them a second time because i got up and they were like please please i'm starving. so hungry you haven't been fed in days and then james said oh i fed them and i said oh i fed them too so they got a <laughs> double dose of dry food this morning manipulative kitties I will feed feed them though. Oh, at least a little bit. Half, but half. funnily enough, Atari's here. Atari's not even crying for food, so he looks pretty plenty full and hot by the by the looks of things. He's fully melted on the floor right now. What cat doesn't manipulate its humans? I know. Yeah. It's like so. All I have to do is meow, and I get more food. Yeah. Well, gonna, I can do that. Yeah, I can exactly. Come no. on. It's my fault. Yeah, they're master manipulators. They know how to, and they put on their high-pitched meows too. Ooh, like I'm that's baby. that's not something they do in the wild. They no. do not meow. They only meow for humans. And they, Which they is so weird. Turn it up and make it higher pitched. So they remember when they're babies. Yeah. They're like, oh, I get things from my mom, and you're my mom now. Yeah. They turn up their the, the pitch of their their meows to make it sound like oh, little baby sweetie. kittens. Sprite has got the highest pitch little oh, meow. Oh, he, he knows exactly how to do it. Oh, see that? He shoots up. Oh, he does. Sometime if you're above him. I saw that last time I was playing, and I'm like, That's I've never cool. seen that before. And now I know why you, I was above the enemy. Very good. You gotta shoot those guys right away. He's oh. Do they, sh they show up on this level? Um, as you get to the higher, higher more, stages. Do you get more? Um, the red guys? Yeah. Or just um, two? Two so far. I don't know if it goes to three or not. You get up that high. In the levels. No! Ooh, my hand slipped. Yeah, this is a long haul game, too. I can see us having to alternate. Yeah. Yeah. So your hand gets break. a bit of a break. It's not too Ooh, nice. nice. It's not too intense on the joystick. Right it's like a medium needle. intensity. Yeah. But you are moving all the time. And in four directions. Yay! Space General! Bonus ship added. Okay. Yep. Need more though. Need ships. Need more ships. Are you smacking? He's smacking my foot. What? He really wants Bad it. naughties. Yeah, this is the easiest level, which is why it's first. It's the same. I don't know if it gets any harder. I guess, I think they're starting a little lower. Because I almost die, of course. It gets a little. I think they move faster and they start a little lower. So you said you did make it to 21. Uh, yes, which is actually level 26 because there's five yes. practice levels. So on the, the first five are practice? On the lowest. Oh, on the novice. On the novice. Uh, so I still went through twenty-five all the, levels. All the levels in a way. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I see twenty-six levels. You have to make it to twenty-six, which means you went through twenty-five. Yeah. And that's what I have to do here. Um, right now, I'm at five times. 
three. Yeah, this is definitely a lot harder. Guys. And the, uh, the hint for this one is stay on one side, and when it, they dive down, move to the other side. Because you yeah. can't go with the bullets, because no. you will die. He's smacking me. What? He's, He's underneath. Like at, underneath the table here, which I have my feet up on. He's like, get your feet off the table. Um, and he's, he's reaching around and smacking them from under the table. This is the hardest thing. What are you doing? Sure. You're so silly. <laughs> he's very hungry. Or he's not hungry, he just wants food. <laughs> yes. Hard to say. Hunger and food are separate things. You'll always eat the food. He's not always hungry. Or maybe he's always hungry. Possible. Unless he's like just Ah! Can I not get through a whole five levels without dying? As long as you don't lose more than one life, you're okay. Yeah, that's the problem. And that's it! Damn it! So, three times five plus four. Fifteen? Nineteen? Fifteen? Nineteen. Nineteen. Okay, okay. I'll do it. I'll do it next time. I lost like three lives on the yep. first round, which is pathetic. Hey, 48k RAM. What system this is? Is the 2600, which is a good testament to how good it looks. Mm -hmm. If you have to ask, which one could be the 7800? But no, it is a Champ Games masterpiece of Gorf. And it's pretty much five games in one. Five classic games in one. Uh, it is so much fun because you don't really get super bored. Because it's constantly changing. Every level. Some levels are harder than others. And we're going for um, a patch. Yep, shoot the laser dudes. Fast as you can. Um, going for patch number two. I got patch number one the last time we played this game. And in the meantime, somebody got patch number four. One person. Very impressive. I don't think that uh, 200 patches of uh, patch number four are going to be given away. Oh, I run Slip. into them all the time. Oh. Boo! You have to remember my tactic. No, stand, I, stand the left and move to the they, right. They track towards you, which always throws me off a little bit. The yeah. uh, the shots, I mean. They do. Uh, 48k RAM. I just finished a composite mod on a 2600 for a friend. It does not look does not look this good, sadly. Um, yeah, because there's like there's four stages of mod for the 2600. Well, three stages. Of mod. There's the basic, which is RF. Which is everything goes on one wire, audio and video. Um, and then there's composite, where everything, where all video goes on one wire and audio goes on the other wire. Then there's S video, which is three wires, which is audio on one, uh, Luma, which is brightness, which is black and white, and Chroma on another wire, which is a color. Then you get to RGB, which is this, which is on four wires. No, stop it. Red, green, blue, and audio. So, um, really, but you have to have either a TV that can support the RGB or an upscaler, which is what I'm using, because I have it outputting to start. And then SCART is upgrading, up going, um, upscaling to HDMI. Um, or you can get component output. And some TVs have component. Or if you're in Europe, they have SCART. Some of some the older TVs. Um, or if you have S-Video. Some, some TV, most TVs have S-Video. We CRTs. Ooh, that was a good shot. RF channel three all the way, Charles Whelan says. I've seen very good RF. Um, because a lot of the old TVs with RF have like really nice 
filtering and analog filtering, I guess. Um, 48k RAM. Oh yeah, this is an RGB. Yeah. I always try and get, with my systems, the best available. Whoa, that was close. Oh, you're going the wrong way. You have to go the other way. Yeah, I always forget which way it tracks. It goes towards you. Yeah, the UIV didn't like the 2600A board as well. I think the diodes and the two Luma signals are causing issues. I'll, I'll play again if okay. you want a break. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. EVG Double Down says it also depends on the mod circuitry as well. Yeah, yeah, some mods are better than others. This one is crystal clear, like really good. I mean, there's some interference just because this is, room is a, the opposite of a Faraday cage. <laughs> it's like full of signal. The FCC would not like me. <laughs> They're like, you're bleeding signal all over the place. We gotta shut you down. I've tried to clean it up. I've done a lot of cleaning of the wiring in the past couple months. So now we only have two consoles out at a time now. And it's much easier to plug things oh, in, actually. Uh. 48K Rams is not a fan of video mods that basically replace the original video chips. Yeah. Uh... With RGB, you're going for that because it doesn't have RGB built into it. So it's 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 a personal choice, really. Um, because some people would say, "Oh, the RGB is not the real video signal. You're basically changing what was intended originally and doing some something it's not supposed to do." But S video is like the highest you can do at that point. Then if you just want to tap into the original, because the RGB actually inter like um, captures the video information off of um, the TIA chip, because you plug the TIA chip onto um, the RGB board. So some people are like, ah, that's cheating. But I don't think it's cheating. I'm still using the original console, the original cartridge. 48k RAM, so I'm not saying it's a bad mod or anything, but at that point it's personal preference to emulate the... To just emulate the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, and, and to each each person their own. Um, me, I don't... I'd rather do this than emulation. Um, but you can get very... Oh, you... Just clipped it, I went yeah, to the right you went to the wrong the way. Um... That's why I stayed going you know, on this one as much as I possible. I try to, but I also find further away. It's, ah, it's I, I hesitate to go back and forth, and then I, I'll go right back into a shot. Ooh. Yeah, this game is is a masterpiece. It's beautiful. <laughs> Looks so good and so much going on. I mean, com compared to like this is an extension. He did this after uh, Galaga. Mm. Um, so this Very would use similar technology like a whole new um a whole new um kernel of course but similar similar styles of being able to put things on the screen as well. the number of characters across the screen like objects um things diving similar to galaga Go for a second. Kind of vulnerable when he first shoots his laser because it's a very sh slow laser so you're able to get under the laser shoot and then get away i don't know if that's a tact a good tactic or not i'm not sure whether to get under grouping him it whether getting rid of the guys who group up with three i think it is because there's more room to maneuver well they come have... down as three and then they're a bit of a wall you have to yeah. dodge so i, think I can see that is a being... good idea 
a good tactic to keep yourself alive. But throughout this game, moving to the opposite direction of the bullets is the biggest thing you can do. Like, see, these dive. I stay on the right, then I move to the left. I'm on the left, and then I move to the right, and then shoot him as he passes that final. Yeah. That's that's my big tactic. Well, once you know which direction they're moving in. They always, I always stay to the left of them, right? So right here, I'm to the right of him. He's going to dive to the to the right. Then I move under him, shoot him. His yeah. bullets go past him. In general. <laughs> in general, yeah. It only works on some bullets. Nice! 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 That Love was it. fast. That is the ultimate way to do it. This. Staying at the bottom. Being very defensive. It doesn't get harder. He doesn't get lower. He doesn't speed up. So you can take your time with this one. I don't think he gets lower. He kind of dives up here. He moves a little bit. He doesn't get lower and lower and lower. No. Like some other, the other levels. No. Where there's stays, like a time. He stays at the top. The where there's part. like a time limit. And you're like, you will die if you take too long. Ooh. This one, you won't die if you take too long. Hmm. As far as I know, maybe I just you get him. You still have to dodge, time. though, what he's shooting at you. So. Eh. It's not like you can just sit at the bottom and no, not die. You do have to move. Yeah, you do. But the bullets aren't so fast, you can't dodge them if you're playing defensively. Which is what I'm going to do for you. Nice. Yeah. Beautiful. Thank you, Gorf Sensei. <laughs> well, I wouldn't go that far. It's it's one tactic that works for me. Who's <laughs> what? First five levels. I have to do it five times, five rounds. Yes. Five mm -hmm. rounds. Boom. Five. Good start. Exactly. Yeah. Very good start. Kept all my guys. Oh, someone did something. What was it? Oh, 48k round, thank you for the 48, I forget what those things are called. Bits. Bits, thank you. Little bits. And they work, like, the name Bits works really well for us, yes. too. I don't know what it actually does for us. <laughs> it's just nice. I don't know. Well, Is it money? Is it, like, actual... I think that each one is a cent? It's a, yes. Uh, but they, um, you can do things for them. I mean, that's what you spend, right? To highlight messages and things like that. The kitties are, uh, so after this game, I it's think it. they would like some, some treats. Yes, if anyone has some treats. Treat, uh, some points to Three points? Yeah. yeah. Tact to get rid of those laser guys as fast as possible. Because really, you have, like, only half the screen to move. These guys don't shoot, so it's not so you can just try it. There we go. And we should go to the arcade soon. Yes. We haven't been there in a while. And, it has been a while. And at VRG, I, I saw the owner. Yes, he was there. And he's there. like, your Satan's Hollow score was beaten. I'm like, no. Boo. Actually, I think I was always second. I don't think I had first. I, I think you did have second, not first. Yeah. So first was I still high. need... No, nah, it's not much higher than my score. Oh, really? Except mm. at the score that I got, it gets really hard. Oh, it does. So I think yeah. I need to practice on main um, before I go next time. Yeah. This is the most dangerous level. Yeah, bits are basically directly money in your pocket. Well, thank you for this. Thank game. you so much. Channel points are the redeems, which sadly I have insufficient number of rewards to uh, get out. Yeah. You gotta watch more. <laughs> That's all. That's all you have to do is is just watch. Yeah, watching continuously gets you the. Yeah. Too high up there. Got the channels. Yeah. And you can feed the kitties. Um, so you see my tactic of like shooting them when they're small. Yeah. Just staying right in the center. But you do have to time it. Oh, pretty well, tightly to shoot them when they're strong. It's kind of random, but kind of not random at the same time. I kind of shoot in the middle of where they are, the middle of their um, their circle, like their circle movement when they're small, and that gives you two chances to hit them, right? When they're at the top of their circle, and then at the bottom of their circle. If you stay on the side, you only have one chance to hit them. Is when they're on the left. 
or on the right. And if you're shooting on the left or the right. Oh, we attacked it. Defensive on this level. Works really well, but it's hard because he speeds up and slows down. So it's like the time is super hard. I think he only has really two speeds. Slow. Oh, when he's moving. Yeah. His fast fast speed and the slow speed. So he decelerates quite quickly. 48k Ram says, I haven't played our Gorf Cap at the local arcade in far too long. Actually, I wonder if it's even out after they moved last month. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah, the arcade that we like to go to, I think they do swap out their machines. He has Once in that. a while. Um, but a lot of them, I think a lot of the... Very constant. Yeah, the popular games stay out, so... Yeah. Come on. I got that one. Yeah, he hasn't moved Satan's Hollow. No, that's still been out there for quite a while. Yeah. And Bosconian. I hope he never moves those two. They do have Major Havoc out now, which is awesome. I don't know Major I've, Havoc. I'm not super familiar with that. Is that the... Um, one where you kind of go into a maze and it's vector based. I've never played that one. It looks very interesting. And it looks like it could be made on a 2600 like, with a lot of difficulty. You'd have to be a master programmer. Anybody confirming is that the right one? Yes, Atari Color Vector. It was sort colored. of berserk like. Yeah, but you're kind of floaty at the same time. Oh god. I'm your laser, dude. There we go. Now things will be better. Yeah, I've never played that. I should, I should play that. And I don't know if it's ever. Are there any systems it was ported to? It's hard as nails, too. <laughs> Looks very hard. It's very floaty. Um, there's gravity, but it's also like really low gravity, I think. Um, but I haven't played it, so I don't. Other people's playthroughs. It does look very interesting. It, it is a right for a port. Two-way roller wheel. It's on the Atari 50 collection. Oh, oh it is. Oh, I have Atari 50. Okay, so I should check that out on the PS4. I think it, is. it features one of our T-shirts in the Atari 50 collection. Yes, yes. On the uh, interview with yeah. um... Tim. Tim of Legend. Yeah. Tim of Legend. Sorry, Tim. <laughs> He's nice enough to wear one of our shirts for yeah. his interview. He's he watches the cool. show once in a while, at least. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, super cool. Because our kitty's poking nice out. The what? Because he had an overshirt as well, so it has, like, the kitties poking out. You can oh, see yeah, them. you could see them. Yeah, yeah. The one with the cats and the, the Zero Page logo, which yeah. is a nice one. Forget K Ram. Sheesh, sheesh. Seven ads. Okay, back in a pit. Sorry. Oh, that sucks. To subscribe. <laughs> you don't get ads when you subscribe. Hi. Oh, 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 it's a cat. Hi. It's a cat. It's a cat. Hi. These guys seem to be doing well in the heat, though. Yeah, they're they're coping quite we recently. Put, we put a big, it's like a big dog bowl of water for this guy, because he'll stick his paws in and flick it around. His and paws get so his hot. Paws get, oh! oh no! So do they only give you three? No, there's some reserve. Nice. I wonder how many reserve oh. you get. Because I should have two in reserve. I should have five. Now oh, four. Oh, that's good. So it still says three. So. They're coming a bit faster than the bullets. I wasn't playing super proactively or defensively because the, the red guy was coming at me too. So I just turned it down. Ah, come on. 
hard. It's such a tiny little spot you have to shoot in. Sometimes you get lucky and it just... One more shot. I know, he almost got gotcha. you. What's that game? Oh, Cuphead. You have to. Oh, even God. when you kill the de the, the boss, right sometimes the you can still be killed. And, then, and the first time I was playing a boss, I was like, I did it! And yeah. I took my hand off the controller and I died. I'm like, oh my God. No, you have to keep playing. Yeah, right to the very, very. very I'm very close to finishing end. Cuphead. That's I think really I'm good. At 70, 75% now. Okay. On the hard level. Yeah. Um, I still have DLC after that. I think I played a tiny bit of DLC. Oh, yeah. No. I looked at it. Gotcha. Bust. So hard. More than halfway, but mm. uh, it's, it's yeah. harder. <laughs> so. Luckily, I've been able to retain some. good, decent buffer for when it should get really hard. But I'm just going for the patch. I'm not trying to beat S. Ramirez with level 96. Yeah, no one's trying to beat S. Ramirez. <laughs> Except that one. Guy. What system is this? This is a 2600. With an Atari box, actually. Yeah. That's why you're hearing the voices. Oh, uh, I was not thinking on this level. I, I forgot to shoot the... You're just dodging. Sometimes you just have to be defensive, though. Yeah, but I wasn't even thinking. And, um... Take, a, take care of enough of them, you won't get swarmed. Yeah. Early. Yeah. As early as possible. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Faster and their bullets get faster with more of them. I can't imagine gravity, fighting gravity on this level, too. Gravity, is that the advanced? Yeah, it's challenge mode, yeah. You get pulled in at the same time, so you have to fight against another force. Although, stuff like that is a matter of just getting used to the gravity. Like, once. You just be pulling the, back the, whole the time. mechanics. It's probably not much worse than the normal game. But. Yeah, just have to be prepared for it when it gets to this level, right? Oh, I didn't even see that. He was so low when he threw that one out. Don't, don't do it. One time I was playing, and it brought me back just before the guy was that. ready to hit me, and I was like, "Come on, so cheap." Cheap death. It was such a cheap death. It was so bad. When he, he's low when he throws one. Damn it. So These guys are just. Yeah. They're not hard. Just gotta just... get him out of the way quick. Yeah. Play defensively, get him out of the way, make your big opening, stay away from their bullets. Oh, they're going faster, the ship's bullets. Oh, yeah. We'll have enough time. Just always go the opposite way. Do not try and follow them because they're the same speed as you. You will die if you try and run away from them. Run towards them. And I was almost a bad <laughs> While I was demonstrating running towards them. doesn't really fire at you directly. It's kind of firing... It's firing from the same point. point. Oh, yeah. yeah. Level five. Last Woo. five rounds. Woo. With four men? Five men? It's our time. Yeah, since the beginning of time, man has waged war on gravity. <laughs> that's right. That's <laughs> from... I know that's from something. gives you more time to hit, hit them to them, uh, true it? before they start moving so yeah. maybe it's not a good tactic they're starting really low now super low shoot move out of the way shoot move out of the way 
until they cross you and then it's that was bad. Yeah, Four left to go. Oh, went really low. Oh yeah. Almost like starting all tumbling. <laughs> yeah. These guys don't shoot. So as long as you get the lasers first, you're pretty clear. You just gotta dodge. Yeah. Oh, three to go. All right. Okay, shoot. These guys first. Oh, come on. Them while, while they're diving, take off a couple. Ooh, ooh, that was a surprise, that last little bullet there. Very devious. Yep. Very devious. Now for the top. Oh, level. I, yeah. You tell me that twice. Sometimes no, he ran away. No. Oh, what is this movement? What was that oval movement? Very weird pattern he's got. No! <sighs> don't, don't. Oh, naughty. Oh, very naughty. Oh, that went right through him. <laughs> I agree. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bouncy. Very bouncy movement. Oh my god, I don't like this movement. It's like oval. Oh, just go. Go away. See, that's the movement I was talking about. They're yeah. changing the movement on these higher levels. At least they just disappear. Yeah, they and don't you can come get back. to the next level. Oh, yes! <gasps> Very nice ending. Oh. Attack, attack. Play defensively, and I'll be just fine. I'm not talking too much. I don't want to. <laughs> yep. Focus. There we go. All the red guys are gone now. Take out a couple blocks. Oh. They are coming faster. For sure, I think. Nice. <gasps> yeah, 26! Woo! Patch number two. Yep. I'll just play up my lives. Space Avenger. Bonus ship added. Patches. Yay, patch. Oh, look how low they are. Insanely low. Good. I should take up the one. Oh! <laughs> Damn it! Is, yeah. Mm, don't change my pattern. Don't change my attack pattern. Even though they're super low, it's really dangerous. <laughs> Bad move, Space Avenger. <laughs> yeah. Great title, though. I like that. Oh, boy. Oh, come on. Oh, gotten away again. There's just too many of them. <gasps> Eep! There we go. Hi! I know you're hungry. You have double breakfast. <laughs> But what about breakfast third breakfast? And breakfast? Second breakfast. He's like, third breakfast, please. I'm a hobbit. Third breakfast, yes. please. Yeah, I know. Third breakfast. Yeah. I've never seen a game of Gorf go on this long. Quite hectic, yeah? <laughs> it's, well, it's. Some people hit, what, 96? Vision 90, 96? Yeah. What was it? 100, I think. Actually. 96. No, he hit 100, 100 on one of them, yeah. Wow, probably the easiest oh, one. Oh, Ramirez. <laughs> yeah, he's the master. Steve. He's got to reclaim his title, though, from yeah. uh, Mr. Triple J. It's 
Probably working on it. Oh, look how many. There's so many now. Because it, it shows you the number you have to kill or yeah. get through. What a, what a and it starts with four in the middle. Crazy. I wonder, there must be a maximum. Or does it just keep increasing? No, there's it a It would maximum. go on forever. Oof. It would. It would just be... Like this level would just get so oh, long. Firing rapidly. I think there's a maximum. They just get harder. Ooh. So hard. Ooh, don't. You don't. What? Oh my god, that was close. Put me in a line of fire. Line of fire. What? Uh, I didn't even see that one coming. Don't. 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 Move up. Uh. One more. No, no. Oh, one more. No, Tiny. One. How do you need stars? No. How do you target 2600, dude? Hey, target 2600. Dude. He hasn't been here in a while. We've yeah. not been streaming no, too much. No, we're in the summer. Last little, little summer while, break. So. Thank you for joining us today. We're back to the re regular scheduled program on Tuesday with some world premieres. James just got his second patch. Yep, I'm just playing because out my lives. His goal today. Minimum goal. Minimum I'm going to try for the next one. All right. It has Ooh. to be on advanced, right? Yeah. Third, third. What's how, how many do you have to do on um, a I'll look it up. Next? It's 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I knew, yeah. I knew that one was going in as soon as I shot it. With all these patches, your jean jacket's gonna look so boss. Going into the arcade with that jean jacket yeah. covered in patches. I don't know how you would um, put those patches on something without destroying them. Because if you iron them, you destroy them. If you sew them, you destroy them. It has to be like how you did it on that sash, where it's in pockets almost, but transparent pockets. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, I'm so low on that. I think I've lost all my lives on the circular one. Oh, they're terrible. That is the hardest level for me. Just the timing is so precise with those guys. Yeah. Especially when they're small. Because you kind of want to get them when they're small and far off. But... Yeah, this is the maximum. Yeah, four in the middle and then the, 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 the oval. Yeah. Yeah, 12. Three, three, three. Yeah, so 12 ooh, ooh. plus 4, so 16. 16 total? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Computer number. Guessing they just get more shooty as you go. Uh, Rapid fire, yeah. the bullets get faster, they get faster. They're kind of maxing out, I think, now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's those cheap shots when they're close to you and they shoot. That's... Oh, yeah. uh, that was way too high up there. That was just dumb of me. It's just less reaction time. Get the mothership one more time. I'm happy. Tight oval? Very nice. easy. Yeah, those tight ovals, they hardly move, so it's quite a lot, a lot easier. Okay, easy. Up the top if you don't shoot them. 
At least they don't shoot at you. They're not a threat. They're just a... They're just kind of blobby and get in your way. They're like those things that come down on Arkanoid. Oh, thank, thank you. you! To who? 48k Ram! Oh, thank you so much! Get celebrating my... Uh... Celebrating all the victories. Yep. I want to get you one more time, and then I'll be happy. So Atari 2600 dude asks, what's the patch score? It's actually the number of missions, so you have to hit... 26 on this level. 26 on standard. Yeah. So this is patch number two. Yeah. So I'm happy now. No, not 48,000 points. 48, oh, I got 48,000 48,000! Thank you. Ooh, oh, so it's a special you. number for him. Yes. Space Master. Space Master. It's good practice anyway for the next Round. patch I need to get. Actually, I'm pretty confident now. I don't well, know how much harder it gets, though. Like, does it just I think it start starts five here. ahead almost? Like, yeah, I bet it does. Other than the gravity, that's only on challenge mode? Yeah, that's okay. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. It was a bad position. I was in. Yeah. Right into the that laser. laser's much faster now. Yeah, he's he starts shooting much. much oh, slower. that's fast! That laser. That is a big increase from last uh, level. I didn't expect it to be that fast. That's what killed me. Mm. Come on, come down. Excellent. Four nine one five. Two. Nostalgic. Forty eight k ram. 48,000 or 49,152? <laughs> he's right. Okay, says good you'll get some <laughs> treats in a second. Yeah, just, you'll get them. I have one more life to no, go. No, he's, he's playing his game. Might as well put in a good score if I'm already going on this level. Oh, oh there we go. 53,670 on level... We'll see. 6 times 5 plus 3... 33? Space Master. 38. Yeah, 38. Long calculation. Excellent. Very good. Very good, yes. Well okay. above what I needed. Very good. Like 26 is what I needed, right? Yeah, so what was, uh, maybe what was patch 3 again? You had it on the screen, I think, did you? Or? Um, patch 3... Yeah. ...is... I hate when you click on a computer. Uh, 36 for Space Master. So, so I'm very confident. 36 on advanced difficulty. Yeah. Okay. I think I, I'm quite confident. That you can do it? Yes. Okay. I'm with, doing this just to give him a break. With I will not get very far, but I might as well swap it up to advanced. and. Oh, thank you for posting that nostalgic. It was a good game. Are you playing on the harder level? Yeah. Oh, you are. Okay. Might as well. we'll get a little sneak peek at how it starts. They're you quite, as well. They're way higher. Well, they're higher, they're but I feel higher like they're than shooting where I faster. Ended. Or more frequently, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. It's hard on the level one. Yeah. So they are starting high. Uh, a hint on this game: you want to get the edge guys because they keep going down when they hit the edges. Yeah. And they'll get boom, 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 really quick. So I work from the left to the right. I, I'm done. I, I, no, 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 no. I, I just don't care at this okay. point. I'm going to start over. Hit it. Mm. There we go. Um, if anybody wants to... Nope, wait. Cats. Cat treats. Anybody have some bits for the kitties? They're very hungry. They haven't been fed yet because they got double breakfast and they don't deserve it. But they do deserve treats. Anyway. If anybody has bits to give to a poor kitty... Yeah. Maybe they don't. They may not. We could just give them some. I don't know if I can trigger it. I might be we'll able wait. to. Oh, I don't know if I have enough. Short points. on channel points. Yeah. Oh, no. That's okay. Okay, you trigger it. Try and trigger Oh, there Yay, we go. Yay, teleprompter. Oh, my God. Look at that cat. Oh, that's Bolt cat out. craziness. Reset the score to zero, zero. Oh, the crying. I'm going to let you put those out here. Is everybody ready? Thank you, teleprompter. Thank you so much. The cats love you. Ready, kitties? Are you ready? Say yes. Okay. Yeah, okay. Here we go. Oh, one's for the black kitten. Gotta throw it way over there. Come on, Atari. Oh, oh. Atari. 
Another one for Sprite. No, he's fine without the door. Is he? He ran out the door when I closed it. Yeah, because he's crazy. Oh my goodness. Another, Another one for one. Sprite. Another one for Sprite. Atari! Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, it missed it. That wasn't enough. Too light, Sprite. Oh, still too light. Oh, Atari is catching up. It's two points for Atari now. Three. Oh, he's pawing oh, the carpet. I kind of heard it. I kind of heard it. Oh, I didn't hear I it. I did. It was very, very Oh, Oh, four, gentle. two. Nope. Bring it. There 50. we go. Atari is catching up now. Good. Yeah. Oh, oh, five, three Sprite. for Sprite. He can catch it in the air, that cat. Wow. Yeah, because he knows he gets it tossed. Oh, right. six, three Ooh. for Sprite. Oh. oh, come on. Try harder. There Good you go. Key. Four for Atari. Oh, Sprite is pulling ahead. Seven, four. That, what? Oh, he got to throw it over there. I tried. He caught it in the air. <laughs> oh, that's Sprite. Atari did not get that. Come on. Come on, Atari. Bring, it. Bring the bell. No. Nope. Nope, a little better. Oh, you're in good position now. Oh. Harder. <gasps> double, double. I heard both. Oh, oh, oh. Atari and Sprite. It yes. is now game point for Sprite. Uh, I don't think Atari has a hope at this point. And it's oh, over. Oh, good job. 10-5 ten, ten for Sprite. Consolation trait. There you go. Yeah. Yay, thank you, teleprompter. What's the total head-to-head -head score? Oh, it's definitely Ooh. Sprite, although Atari does occasionally... Sprite dog. You have to go back over all the games and... Somebody else. Yeah. Do it as an annual tournament, see who who's who comes first in the standings, right? Yeah. Are you going to go yeah. or is it... I'll do another one if you want. Okay. If you want... Do you want a break or...? Um, you can have one more game. Okay. I'm not very good at it, but that's okay. Um... Remember, shoot all on the left yeah. or the right first. It's usually, that over. is usually my... How's your foot healing? It is very good. Much better than it was. Um... So... Let's see, what can I say about it? It's it's growing out uh, my toenail. It hasn't fallen off. Like at first, that little corner fell off. But that was a long time ago. No more has fallen off. There's kind of on the left of it. You can't see it. It's too small now. Um, on the left of it, there's this kind of quarter circle um, that's kind of purple. The new nail is growing in, and it's about almost half an inch at its height. So it's almost like there's two nails. One underneath, and one on top. Um, I, Tanya thinks the on top nail is going to fall off I think so. as a big chunk one day. Yeah. But I don't know, because it's, it's pink for most of it. So oh, it's healthy underneath it. Um, hey! Be nice to the bratwurst. I'm not being bad to the bratwurst. <laughs> um, so I would say another couple months, and I can, and it'll be evened out, and it'll kind of look more normal, and then just the undernail will just be growing in, and it'll just be a like a nine-month process. So very good. Okay. Try an easier game. <laughs> Try an easier game. I'm, g I'm gonna grab a drink because it's quite okay. hot. So, do you need anything? Are you okay? No, I'm good okay. with water. I'll be right back. Okay, advanced patch now. Let's see how we do here. I mean, it's gonna start off fairly easy. I don't know how much it sets back, but I think we're kind of banking on like five levels back. So it's if, so I made it to level 38, so I need to do better than that this time. But not much better. And now I have more practice by doing like super hard levels. So I should do better on earlier in the game. But I didn't really lose any lives until quite a bit later. I didn't get the laser. Oh, yeah. I got in the way. Then after three patches, I will claim my patches because I really don't think I 
can make it to level 58 or whatever it is that is needed for the fifth path, fourth patch. Um, but you never know. I mean, this will dictate a little bit about how I will do for the fourth patch. I'm not sure the difference between the difficulty, like what is added, because it's above and beyond the arcade for the... Oh my god! That does not bode well. That was an onslaught. I don't think I ever saw that at any point in the last time. This is only first time. Three came at me at once, all in a hail of bullets. It was really bad. Ice cream, Ice cream truck! Sometimes they come in for another pass. Seems like, well, why did he dare this way off the screen? I didn't expect him to, to do that at all. Yeah. Lucky. So a little bit of yeah, His bullets are very fast, actually, starting off. So I think it, it is. Higher than five more levels. Mm -hmm. I twice. Really? My first round. Oh no! Very it is hard. harder. It is harder. Yep. Oof! That was I so I feel like close. that should have gotten in. <laughs> yeah, but he's moving at the same time, so it's like oh. oh. Oh, yeah. Hit the side of the nice, <clears throat> nice job, Sprite again. Yeah, he's, he's a very talented he's cat a, with the bell. Food he's fast at eating, but he's also very good with the bell. Yes. So that those two in combination yep. is just brutal for for Atari to keep up. But Atari Atari can hold his own. I find he's just less interested. Yeah. Sprite's like, oh yeah, bring it on. Food all the time. Yeah. Yum, 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 yum. He is a baby kid, too. Yeah, he's cool. Yeah. How old is we Atari think. now? Seven? Seven? Uh, Sprite? Yeah, seven. Not even two. No, he just had his so, first birthday not a couple a lot months of, ago. He's got a lot of high... He's a high metabolism cat. He's got a lot oh, of energy. Yeah. Oh, my God. Well, I got the laser guy. It's not good. This is not going well. I'm losing more lives than I'm gaining. Gotta be way more defensive. Now. Oh come on, don't play. I'm I'm terrible at playing shots. Oh, they corner you. You can't end up in the corner. It's terrible. That is damn, very poor. Cool. This is harder. Like, much earlier. Um, level nine. Level eight. Down to zero lives. Ridiculous. How he got that on challenge mode. Oof. Yeah. some of that? Yes. Yeah. Peach. Peach. Clementine. Peach. Oh, I don't like Clementine. It's so bitter. It's not too strong, though. Mm-hmm. No, very good. Yeah, isn't it nice? It actually almost tastes like apricot. Yeah. Rather than peach. Yeah, the combination very of the two. tasty. Yeah. Thank you for asking about my foot, Atari 2600 dude. Has been a while. Yeah, I mean, I can walk on it and everything. I, I really don't think about it day to day. Like, the nail doesn't catch on anything, so it's, it's, it's 
just a waiting game now. It's gonna take a year. Poor Atari. Freaked out and bit my toe. Saw me as the enemy. He lost it. Lost his he mind. He became feral cat for a moment there. Poor guy. Poor guy screaming his head off. Oh, he was so, so freaked out. Poor, poor. I think it was more the fact he was stuck than he was hurt. Ah! It's too much to keep track of it once. <laughs> Because he was, he was hurt, definitely, because he was pulling on his own leg. Which didn't help. He's got so much to help going on. They just try and get away. Um, I think it was more freaking out, like somebody, like somebody had a hold on his leg. Oh, jeez. You do have to get closer. Was there an event during tree time? An event? Oh, no. This <laughs> no, is old This is event. old. Um, you have to go... That it. happened like, I don't know, three, four months ago? Four months ago? Yeah. Yeah, Atari got his leg caught in the um, swinging door of the shower and hurt himself, and I tried to rescue him, and he bit my toe very badly. Yeah. Right through the nail with his tooth. Yeah. Like, like, puncture wound, like, oh, Yeah. To the very doctors. Poor. Yeah. Yeah. Like, to the point where we are like, do we need to go to Emerge? <laughs> yeah, it was very close. It was very close. Bleeding profusely. Oh, went right into that. I know, I know, I'm distracted. You were fine, and you went into it. No, because oh, yeah, one went that way, one went that way, so oh, it's dodging thing, one. Yeah. yeah. Five minutes ago, James was fine with water. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm fine with water. Can I have some of yours? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, that always happens. Grass is always greener, right? Oh, yeah. that sounds good. Mm. It is very good flavor. You said you had it somewhere and you're like, it was really good? That flavor? This flavor? Uh, no, just this brand, the San Pellegrino. Um, this isn't like the full um, sugar one. It's like oh, the it's 35 totally calorie fine. one. Does that artificial? No, it's made with fruit juice. So good. But it's just not as sweet as the normal fizzy one. I really like it. It's, it's my favorite flavor now. Like, it's that good. From one sip, I can... Yeah. No, can no, they're very definitively good. Definitively say that's my favorite flavor. I, uh, they're very good. They were on sale, which is usually when I end up buying stuff that... Uh, well, that's how they get you. Well, yeah, because they're always like, oh, they're more on sale. expensive I'll try than, this out. than, you know, Diet Coke. But, you know, yeah. it's all good. Okay. Yeah. Well, well, the good ones are always hard. But, um, anyway... Yeah, I uh, not a sponsor, but uh, no, no. very good, very tasty. Nothing's a sponsor. Uh, Atari twenty six hundred Deed says I watched the last patch challenge on YouTube. Corey seems like a great guy. He's awesome. Will he be a regular on the show? Uh, he said he'd, he'll come back. Yeah. So um, he's he doesn't live nearby. Yeah, so it's hard. So he comes and visits from time to time. He actually phoned to, phoned me today. So. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he found some Atari games at a flea market. Oh, that's why he was phoning. That's why he was calling. Okay. Yeah, we were in the car picking up one of the boxes. Yeah, um, <laughs> the boxes we showed. So I couldn't answer show. it, but then he phoned again. Um, yeah, he was he was asking if I had those games, and I did. Um, it was a Zonox uh, Double Ender. Oh. I'm like, oh, these are pretty rare, rareish. And the other one was uh, Infiltrate. Um, Um, but I, I had both of them, so he's he's gonna put it up at his recording studio. Um, the games. Oh, I see. It's all the retro and '80s with the music that he does, right? Yep. Is he talking about the music on the show? Uh, briefly. Yeah, we mentioned the name of the band. We didn't really get into it. Maybe next time we'll talk more about music. Oh, come on. Why did I do that? Oh, it's terrible. Even better than last time, but that's not the same. I'm playing defensively. It is definitely harder. Oh, yes. It is yes. definitely faster. Everything's At least oh. 10 levels up, I think. Yeah. At least. In the advanced. Oh. Ooh, that was threatening. Yeah. Their bullets are faster. His boys' bullets are faster. The bullets are. Oh my god! 
terrible. Why I don't lose any lives on this guy. I lost two. You got treats. You just got treats. Oh, his bullets are more of an angle, I think. Yeah. That's the ones that got me. I was trying to run away from them. Yeah, you can't. Really. You cannot run you away from them. You have to go these. go across them. Yeah. As you mentioned. Oh, my goodness. Yay! Uh, the skill you built up since the last challenge is pretty impressive. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. it, it, it's, I'm much better Practice. at this now. <laughs> I think I said that, that to, um, I mean, I've said it over and over again, mostly to John, um, John Chapo, about his games making me a better player on the arcade oh, yeah. of the games that he ports. Well, he's porting pretty hard games sometimes, so you really yeah. do need to practice them to oh, you do. get your skill up. Um, and his games are such so close to yes. the arcade that the skill translates one to one over. Um, it's not like, oh, it's kind of the same. It's like, no, it's it's Hi. like perfect. You're not getting more. Let me handle this guy. Do not get distracted by the black kitten who's begging at your face. His tail is nice and cool, so it's kind of nice. a nice cool tail? No, it's going down my neck. Ooh, little guy. Look at this tail. So fluffy. I found, I had this. Oh, why is, yeah, this guy's moving. I had moving. him last, when I played it too. This guy's moving fast now. This was harder to get because he wasn't. Oh! <gasps> Because his laser very much. is faster too, so oh. you can't. It's hard to get under him, so you have to shoot him while he's moving yeah. almost. Yeah, there's so many bullets now in this one. You really have to use that tactic of drawing the bullets in. RC70 says, "I have the I have the cart, but only played a round or two so far." Yeah. Get try and get the first patch. Um, I I love patches because they give you an incentive to get a lot better at the game. It's like you have a goal, mm -hmm. and then you just keep trying and trying, and you have to build up your tactics um, and really learn the intricacies of the games. And so I'm really happy that he did a patch for this one. Very far from the patch. Oh, it's 16 already. That's really low. You're in round two and it's already at 16 maxed of these out. guys. It's already maxed out, yeah. yeah. So you are starting well ahead of standard. Oh, yeah, that's standard. a good way to judge it, actually. Yeah. Oh. I got him, though. Oh. I'm Rough. dead. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah. I'm round two. Mm. And what do I have to get? 36. So 35, 7. I have to get to level 8. Oh, it did worse. Okay, mm. you get to play one. You died on the same level, though. Almost exactly the same. Yeah. But uh, it was the same. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, I'll do two more games, and if I'm not, like, massively improving, we're going to call it. Okay. Um, but I do you want to... You got your patch, so... Uh, I do want to play, um, after this, I want to play Make, um... Oh, we're playing something else? Gravitic Mines. Oh! At least a couple levels. Okay. Because there's a patch for that, too. Well, not a patch, it's a card. Essentially. For finishing the game. And we've made it through quite a lot. I think there's only two worlds left. Planets, you mean? Planets. Yeah. Wonder how many carts Alice sold since he announced that they were being moved from the store. Uh, a lot, enough. Well, he doesn't said how many, but two things I could say about that. One, none of them is sold out yet that I've found. Um, so he either had a lot of stock, or well, yeah, he had a lot of stock. That's all I can say about that. Um, also, what else was, oh, he has, he sold enough that everybody who ordered got a, uh, an email from the Atari Age store saying it'll be two to three months before they're all shipped out. So that's a lot of orders, but he is a one person crew <laughs> uh, shipping all these games, but a two month, um, 
two month lead time. That means a lot of games have sold. Yeah, RC70 says, I got an email that said cart caused a huge influx, which is not surprising at all. And you can see pe how many games people um, purchased um, because people are, are listing which games they bought. Whoa, good dodging. Um, in a thread in the Atari 8 forums saying, I bought these and I listed the, I think, four games that I, oh, that I wanted of Pac-Man pluses so mean. of Bob D. Crescenzo's. Dead. They're all shooters, of course. But I had a bunch of his games already. Ordered Load Runner? I think that's all I still, uh, really still want. Well, Load Runner is, is a masterpiece. So that's a good choice. Definitely a good choice. But of course, Load Runner isn't going away. So, so if, if you're worried about games going away, that wouldn't be one that is going away. But that's fine. Load Run is amazing. Like, you'll have fun for hundreds of hours, actually, I think. 150 levels. Well, each one won't take an hour. I would say it's about, on average, I would say 100 hours worth of fun. Load Runner. Mm. If you're, like, half decent at the levels. Because some of these levels take us an hour. Oh, yeah. Well, well not an hour. Let's say half no, an hour they on don't average. Take that, they don't take that long. Well, let's say 20 minutes on average. They don't take them. Because some are a lot easier. Some are yeah. like, oh my god. The ones god. that are hard take a long time, but most of them you kind of get through reasonably. Yeah. So 20 times 150. It's um, a lot of hours of gameplay, yes. Yeah. 3,000 minutes divided by 60. Which is 50 hours. What did playing. you say? How many le levels? 150 levels. 150 times levels? 20 times minutes. 20 minutes. Okay. Probably convert into uh, So 3,000 minutes? Yeah. And then divide by 60. Yeah. 50. 5,000. No. 500. 500 hours? No. Twenty times fifty. Wait, what did you say? Twenty times fifty. Twenty level. minutes. Twenty minutes. Times one hundred and fifty levels. One hundred and fifty levels. Yeah. Three thousand. Divided by sixty, which is three hundred divided by six, which is. 50. Yeah. <laughs> I was just doubting myself. That doesn't sound right. So yeah, fifty, 50. hours yeah. is is a really good. Oh yeah. Really good amount of time. If, yeah. And I. Thing? You do get to play them again, but mirrored. Oh, really? After you complete all the levels. Really? If I'm not mistaken, I might be mistaken. It might be a different game I'm thinking of. No, I think it might be um uh um Kit Kat. Mm. I think that might be Kit Kat. But the, I, I swear it was for Load Runners one. Come on. This would be the last game. Unless yeah. I do really well, like make it to level four or something. I don't make it to level four, it's just the chance to get Terrible. Oh! I'm always happy getting a patch. <clears throat> like when I'm playing Cuphead, I'm happy when I defeat one boss. One boss, yeah. <laughs> and the other day I defeated three, or three levels. Yeah. Three bosses levels are all the same. Yeah, just on a run. <clears throat> I was doing real well. Um, so is there like a final, final, final boss? Yeah, I think there is. I haven't made I bet it there. it's hard. <laughs> but there's like three worlds, and then there's an extra world, and, gotcha. it, and it's... It doesn't have a list of bosses. Usually there's like a list of question marks and there's just nothing there. <clears throat> but it's not a game you need to cheat on, like look things up. So I did, I've never looked up like a playthrough of the game. 
This is just bosses. And run and gun levels, so. Oh. Uh, RC says, the first game I played that logged hours was FF7, which I assume is Final Fantasy yeah. 7. I was at 80 hours at the end, but I don't think it counted save reloads. I no. think it was more like twice that. Yeah. Yeah, so you have to think about, oh, did I play, actually yeah. play that? Did it save all that time? It's like 80 hours in that one continuous game, but not necessarily <laughs> the stops and starts <laughs> and the reloads throughout. Yeah. I like a game that gets a lot of long play yeah open so world like games like you open get a world lot. rpgs yeah. playing zelda right now it's just You're so much a lot of hours of that oh i am that does count up hours i think the switch it probably does i have had a few <coughs> reloads oh you die a lot well not a lot but for the the main quest bosses sometimes i'll just run out of resources and i'm like i'll re reload like i've used up you kind of figure out how to defeat the boss and realize you don't want to lose everything, oh. and then it's easier to just restart from the beginning and right. take what you've learned. Ray Teresa. It's not... Sort of. <laughs> sort of. You just know you're wasting your time. I've wasted too many too many arrows, or I lose my arrows. It's like, I have to reload. Like, there's I have no to... Point, there's yeah. no point in continuing. Ray Teresa. Yeah. Except without the rage. Yeah. Just a reset. Oh, I didn't realize you could shoot the pieces falling from the flagship until you just did it. Oh. And you get... Oh. Yeah, you can. You get points. You get a lot of points from that. But if you want points. If you don't get lives for them, you just get points. I find it's the most dangerous when you first start because there's so many of them on the screen. This level? And they immediately come down all at once. Yeah. Wow. Right, so Sammy says, Rocket League, I've got over 3,000. Whoa. Nothing will ever whoa. beat that. Well, Rocket League is just... It's play, online play, play. play, right? So you just it's keep the same playing. thing over and over. It's just like a fun game. I enjoy playing Hearthstone. I'm sure I've oh, had so many hours in put Stone. so many hours into that. And I'm not even like that serious a player, but I You're just pretty good. You won I the just, other day. Right? Oh no, yeah, I win. You win a lot. I win little tournaments, but I'm not like not tournaments, tournaments like Ooh. like battleground tournaments. Yeah. Um, but I just like it because you can play against other people and just play a game or two and then you're happy. You Pong know? 3D. It is Pong 3D. Is. That's true. You've got a little car and that's your Pong paddle. Oh, come on. I also refuse to put money into those. Things. No, no, no. That makes you uh, a better player by having to struggle well, with maybe. no money. Actually, but you're going up against people who have put money in, right? Oh, probably, yeah. And you're winning. Sometimes. So that makes you a better Not player. <laughs> Not the best player, but... Yeah, the boat... These, um, the sh their shots are going at more severe angles now. So you have to be careful not to be in that angle. You have to go the opposite direction because you will not outrun that angle. Nice, nice, nice. I love that they, he has some uh, Gorf's, uh, uh, Gorf's security uh, personnel. Yeah. Just, just you know. Some bodyguards. Some bodyguards. Just to make life difficult for me. Security detail, that's what it is. Some red shirts. Some red shirts. What was that? Were they security? Red shirts? Or were they just, uh, just general uh, I people I think they were low-level security. Yeah. Uh, st yeah, I don't know. I'm not a, I'm not uh, that up on the Star Trek, but uh, I feel like that sounds right. <laughs> yeah, because they're always the ones that got hurt, so they wow. it makes sense that so they the, would be so the, the ones in the line of fire, right? They take out their phaser. Or... I'd like to see the stats on that. Oh, somebody has all the stats. On, oh, come on! On, on the, the shirts and the and the death the death rate, I'm oh. sure it's higher than normal. Um, I think I read about it once, and the red shirts aren't really that bad. In I I wouldn't to have others. thought so. I think it's just that people notice it. It's noticeable because they're in red shirts. I, I think I the think... red shirts are like non-people. Usually, they're like nobodies. They don't have a name. NPCs, they don't. Yeah. Even. <laughs> yeah. Yep. One hundred percent. Space Colonel. Ugh. Two ships. It's not good. It's not terrible, but it's not good. Alarm! Alert! 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 In uh, TOG, red shirt means you're an extra and you're gonna die. 
Well, that VVG said TOG, but I think, yeah. The OG? TNG, I think. TNG? Yeah. Okay. TOS? It could be a TOS, TOS. or it could be TNG. TOS, he said. Yeah. I watch out for these lasers because they're so fast. Oh, look at that guy. Did you see him swoop? He just went nuts. Yeah. He, like, went way faster than normal. Like, super speed. Some crunchy. Riker being the exception. Yeah, Riker had a red shirt, yeah. right? Awesome, but... One more. Oh, he passed it. The beard protected him. The yes, beard. yes. The beard the of beard. protection. Yeah. <laughs> it helps. <laughs> Helping in this game. How long have I had this beard for? 2015. TNG red shirt meant command. Would that also be security? Or no, because because um, Worf was security. Was he a red shirt? I think he was yellow. Oh, I don't know. I think he was yellow. I don't know. I don't know. Now I now I need to watch know, the whole series. I want well. Please <laughs> look it up on Wikipedia. Oh yeah, Picard was red too. Oh, okay. Hmm. Ooh, yeah, that's a good one. Ooh. Get to see all the advanced levels now. Uh, advanced uh, movements. Ah, TNG's gold is security and engineering. So. Okay. I just thought it was whatever color you liked. I you Pick know, a shirt off the yeah, rack. Yeah, like they had their they had their designation and the little oh, the dots pips. and and yeah. Again, not a not a military person, but um, I know they have their designations on their on their um, collar. But TNG swapped the meaning of red and yellow from what they were in TOS. Oh, okay. That is a few years on, right? So, yeah. Pips, yeah, pips. Such a creative level. You have to shoot a tiny, tiny thing on the enemy. Or plunk away at him. Oh, gotta make that hole big enough that you can get in there. Yep. I just really lucky or skill. It's luck and skill. Ooh, like, like, that was really good. Like, you can time it, but it's still, like, nice. so hard. mostly peripheral vision that I'm using. I'm like mostly watching the his bullets. Yeah. And then just shooting kind of in the right direction. <clears throat> Level four. Space general. Are you a space general? Almost halfway there. He's a, he's a cat general. Cat general? He says, I command this house. Yeah. Kind of share command. Uh, I think he's Picard. He's in charge. He's Picard and Sprite's Riker. I think I think Sprite is second in command. Oh yeah. He doesn't like to get his paws dirty. This one. No. He sends he's... Sprite out. <laughs> the other day, Sprite was sleeping beside me. Yeah. And all of a sudden, he hissed, and I'm like, "What the hell?" And he was he woke himself up. He was hissing at something from a in a dream, dream. and oh, he woke himself up hissing. It was oh so no. Funny. But you just have to wonder, what was it? Like, what was he dreaming was of? Was it Atari? Was it food? Was it a mouse? Was, was it a another, crow? Was it a cat a... in the house? Yeah. I didn't recognize. Yeah, it was so, so cute, funny. though. Hey, I had, to, ghost. I had to, like, calm him down. He's like, oh, it's okay. It's okay. Nothing's bad here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He woke up in a bit of a so fright. So stressed. So stressed. Oh, my goodness. That was a lot of shot coming down. It was. you got to be skillful at those points. There. Almost. Ooh, good oh, good job! Got him just, Sometimes just. You gotta use your skill. I think you're right about getting getting those master ships. I think so. Um, I think it helps a lot. It saves three coming down at once, and they just shoot like crazy when and, they come down. And dominate the screen. Like, you don't have much yeah. room to escape. Oh, yeah, all of them. Yep, all at once. That's what I wanted. When you're down to four, it's just tumbling. Tumbling, tumbling. All at you. 
Come Thank you. Oh, it was a nice save. It was very, very lucky. Oh, come on. Ah! It's up to three lives! Don't. It's been pretty good now. I was waiting till they're off the screen. Bullets. Oh, oh, cheap that shot. That was cheap. Cheap oh. shot. Lost two lives down in like two minutes. So bad. So bad. Just firing so much. Hey, real? trust me, mouth. Second best person from that one. It's not good. People joining us maybe okay. after their uh, dinner. Sunday dinner. Yeah. Yeah. Well, can you watch this cat? He looks like he's going to be disruptive. No, don't be disruptive. He's going to get on the computer desk. And yeah. Compute. <laughs> Let me stop the stream. Yeah. I would like some food, so you're going to have to end your stream now. <laughs> yep. Whoa. Oh boy, okay. Get those gorfs. The sentry gorfs. Headshot for gorfs. Riker gorfs. Oh my god, that was too close to me. What a terrible shot. back and play defensively. have to make it to level 8 though. 8? I just made it to 5. Oh. So you have to make it through 7 levels. Yeah. So as soon as it says 8, that means I got the patch. Oh my goodness. Well. Three more. Yeah. Oh, how low they're going. Oh, they're so low. No. No. This is very bad. Oh, they're going to get fast. Get the red ones first then. Very dangerous Oops. going underneath those. Oh, I know. That's yeah. so brutal. It's just gonna get like it's just gonna be that and worse from now on. Ooh, missed him. Got him. Oh, they always right away first. Right away, yeah. yeah. They know it's they're like... the bad guys. Why, John? Why? Blame him for some other game. <laughs> he did program it, but he's just following the arcade. Yeah. Ooh, they're so fast. So many bullets. Like three per. Yeah. Oh, this level's so, this level's so long and so dangerous. Novice, it's so easy. They just kind of hang around the middle and you can they shoot them shoot in a all in a row. Yeah. Shoot like once, once every few rotations. Yeah. Now like every, one after, as soon as it goes off the rotation, screen. Yeah. Oh, where did that come from? He wasn't even there. Oh my god, I almost died. Oh. 
Like oh. these ones are the hardest because they're the smallest. Yeah, they're they're very small to hit. Good practice for this level. Just shoot a tiny, tiny little box at the top. Oh my oh. god, they come down so Damn fast! It. No time to move! So fast. That's life! It. Don't get one life every round. Ooh, oh, I stole it. Get out of my way. Yeah, the speed, the movement speed of your ship is starting to be a factor because you can only move so fast, and it's not super fast. It's not slow, but you really got to pay attention to that. And even if you're close, it's good because it picks away at where you need to it, shoot. It widens the, the target, oh. yeah. Ooh. Close. Oh. Come so on. close. It's wide hole now, though. There you go. Woo! Just use a cheat code. Woo! Makes games a lot easier. Uh, well, it does, but I wouldn't get the patch. Ooh, my wrist. Again, sword? This might be it. Yeah. I don't think we can play another game after this, actually. It's okay. We've been playing for quite a while. Space Avenger! Have Woo! I have to get through six and... Se oh, come on. There's no way. There's just no way. So low already. Oh, shot is shot. Just saved myself there. I gotta get one each pass. Nice. That's almost Oof. like you don't have Oof. any room for error now. <gasps> nope. The, uh, I died. Oh my goodness. Well, you, I, you did was, it. That was a very good move. I was in his line of sight. Yeah. And he shot immediately as soon as I appeared. <sighs> That's a good score, though. Oh. That's a good score. 27. That's really good. I have a belief that I can get the patch now for yeah. number three. Yeah. Not today, because my wrist is brutal. It's, it's, it's damaged now. <laughs> DVG Double Down says, I'm kidding. Cheat codes are for cheaters, cheaters. and cheaters never win. That's uh, right. Cheaters frequently win, unfortunately. But <laughs> So I need to do nine more levels. Yeah. It's, you're close. Very close. Yeah. Two more rounds. Yeah. Atari 2600 dude says, are you still going to do the Activision patch challenges? Yep. Those have been on hold. I have the games up here. Mm. They've been sitting up here for years. Um... I need to do um, Hero, Decathlon, Space Shuttle, Dolphin, Robot Tank, Crackpots, Brutal, um, Pitfall 2, Star Master, Grand Prix, Laser Bat Blast, Pitfall, Kaboom, Dragster. Some of those are quite easy, like Pitfall. Um, some of them I've gotten close, like Dolphin and Crackpots. Hmm. Crackpots, yeah. Crackpots get so hard near the patch score. Yeah. Like, so hard. Um, Grand Prix is about memorization, because you're just that race car going up and down. Yeah. Laser Blast is just brutal long. Yeah. It's just brutal. It's a really long haul. There's yeah. two patches for Laser Blast. One is brutal. One is abysmally brutal. <laughs> like, abysmal. Yeah. Like, it's four hours you have to play for. Yeah. That would be the last patch I do is Laser Blast. Second patch for Laser Blast. Um, Dragster um, is very, very hard. You have to be so precise with your joystick movements. Luckily, it's very fast. And the button resets. Unlike most Activision games, but um, um, luckily... Um, Uh, the programmer. Okay. Uh, I interviewed him on the show. What's his name? Guy with beard. Damn it! Somebody else put it in there. Uh, Robot Tank, I think I can do. David, David Crane. Crane. Thank you, David Crane. Uh, Robot Tank, I think I can... Oh, there's four levels for Robot Tank, I think, as well. Okay. I think I've done one or two okay. so far. At least one. 
space shuttle is just very complicated. It's got lots of switches and stuff. I don't think that's hard. It's yeah. just you have getting to, used to that. Getting used to it. Star Master, I've done a couple patches, but I think there's also three or four for that. Different yeah. stages like this. Mm -hmm. uh, um, Pitfall Two is just is just doing it. I'm kind of saving those as an easier one. Yeah. Because it's a platformer, which I like to do. Kaboom. That's just going to take lots of practice. <laughs> lots of practice and a good paddle. And it's also very hard. It's 3,000 points. And I think I got up to around two. But it just gets so hard. Um, dolphin gets very challenging at the high near the patch. I'm not bad at it. Decathlon, I haven't even tried. No. Um, I know that's quite a slog, I think. You know. Pitfall 2 is quite easy to get, yeah. Save that for a day when... Yeah, yeah, when it's like, oh, I need a patch. I need yeah. to <laughs> get a boost in confidence. Um, so that is our show today, yeah. our After Dark. Um, it was fun. It's fun. Successful. I got, I got a patch and I'm yeah. in confidence in the third patch. I think you can get the third. I think um, maybe in like the first round... Um, next time like 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 yeah. you'll warm up and then you'll be ready to to, to tackle it so. and i won't be as as drained and my wrist and your wrist not obvious. hurting as much yeah yeah no that's good stuff yeah good so stuff. let's take a look at the things i've put in the schedule that might stay there it might stay there <laughs> like a 2600 will be the first one coming back a 2600 show with two mm. exclusive premieres intruders and meow 2 meow 2 which is a sequel to meow 1 which had me in it and atari there's a sequel to it already yeah oh my goodness <laughs> and then we'll probably play laser face island and laser face planet and we'll save domino and twisty fruit fly fun uh for another for the next one there's also a puzzle game that I saw come up, and I'll save that for a Tuesday. Mm -hmm. I saw somebody else play it. I haven't looked through the forums today to catch up on mm -hmm. games. Um, we also are going to be doing a, an Atari 7800 game drive special with a live interview with James Bolton, a uh, saint of Retro HQ. That's the new multi-cart for the 7800. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. All the sound chips and all nice. the advanced things and... It also supports BOP chip, and it has an RGB out cable. Um, it also has an attachment that you can uh, buy for using Sega Genesis controllers on the system. Very, very awesome. Did you get the second patch? Yes, yes I did. <laughs> A second patch for Gorf. I'm not going to um, up, like send the info to John Shampoo till I get the third patch. Oh, fair His enough. fourth patch is like... That's a long not term. Not gonna happen. <laughs> it's not gonna right be a away. separate yeah. thing. Yeah. yeah. Um, then I'm not sure what the second like this one is not scheduled, the interview. Yeah. Um, not sure because he's exactly still it's what? still shipping and stuff. Yeah. The the cartridge. Um, um and then we we'll, might do a I don't know uh, what we're gonna do. There's some Lynx games, there's a new Jaguar game. Oh, cool. Um, from John Hancock, um, uh, Blockham Sockham. He's going to be selling that at PRGE. Nice. Um, and it looks, uh, it looks like a fun puzzle game. It's like shooting blocks up and matching blocks and stuff. Yeah. It's very nice looking. Um, but I want to play Drelbs. So I might put 7,800 next on the Friday. That's a fun arcade style game. Yeah. So I might move that up to Friday show with Darcy, yeah. Um, we also have like Coleco Vision special eventually. Um, I want to play Gravitic Mines today, but my wrist, I'm kind of done. We'll do an After Dark <laughs> for just pilot. for that one, then maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's an After Dark. Also, Load More Runner. Load Runner. Continuing on because we did do Load Runner. We got levels 35, 36, 37, 38. Yep. So on from there. Just kind of an add-on after getting a patch after Gorf Arcade. Gotcha. So. And so we'll be continuing with levels 39. Like we're way. We have many to go. That's fine. You can just. It's a long term. Chip away at them. Long term After Dark. Yeah. Um. Uh, Elevator Agent. Eventually, we'll do um, mm -hmm. an update on that. Yeah. 
Uh, PRG, I don't know what we'll be doing for PRG. I know we won't be doing formal interviews this year. Yeah. Because uh, not a lot of the devs are coming. Yeah. Not so as many as last time. year. Not as many. Yeah. Um, I don't know if I want to do anything. Maybe I just want to enjoy myself yeah. for once. <laughs> Um, and just kind of hang around. Yeah. Or, you know, just doing some casual live streaming from like a cell phone. Yeah. Yeah. Because past that, it's like a lot of equipment. Yeah. To, like, and then you have to cart around, cart it, hide it, and, and yeah. Oh my God. Bring it back nightmare. and forth to the hotel. And, hide yeah. it at the Atari Age booth. Yeah. <laughs> um, Atari Jaguar's 30th anniversary special, November 23rd. Oh. When it was released 30 November. years ago. Nice. Okay. So Good we play, stuff. we'll do, be doing something for that. Good. I don't know what. Yeah. Um, we'll see. Um, do you want to do a developer spotlight on Chris Walton? Maybe coordinate that with a release mm -hmm. of his game, probably yes. Xevious. Yeah. Whenever that is uh, updated or done. Um, yeah, we've got lots. Oh, I want to do another Vectrex special. There's oh, another yes. game that got released, but they're so expensive. Oh, yeah. After shipping and conversion, yeah, it's $100. Canadian, yeah. Canadian for a game, and I'm just... I just can't do it. It has to yeah. be a very <laughs> special game. Yeah. And this one looked really good. It was like a... kind of a maze, and you had to shoot out things and shoot um, barriers out. I was like, so close to buying yeah. it but it's, yeah yeah hmm. um would I'll it be something you could pick up at prge or no uh quite possibly yeah yeah and that would save save the shipping and the shipping's a big portion of it yeah like it's it is. a lot yeah so yeah i might maybe look, look for some yeah. uh homebrews but some of these homebrews are limited yeah. runs you don't so find it's like them. Uh, yeah. yeah so i'll be looking for that um also, I want to do a light gun special, so that'll probably be bumped up quite a bit. Um, all the light gun games for the 2600, 7800, 8-bit homebrew, yeah. homebrew light gun. Um, <clears throat> 7800, 8-bit, um, I think that's it, actually. <laughs> um, oh, we're almost back. On Tuesday, we're back back. Officially, officially. Officially, back. officially. We're just doing an After Dark fun thing, but thank you. Yeah. And hi, Rad Castle. Yeah. Um, what other... Um, shows multiplayer marathon actually yes that's another one that we're gonna do point. kind of uh, kind of after when it's hot yeah <clears throat> oh yeah, I was also gonna say keep keep cool out there yeah. I know it's getting really bad in the <clears throat> states yeah like up to 50 Celsius like oh, 120 Fahrenheit oh in like a lot of places yeah that's really crazy that's and they're really saying crazy. like 60 degrees Celsius which I don't even know again like, like Death Valley I don't know what that converts to Fahrenheit, like 140? That's insane. 130, 135, yeah. something like that. That's like you can't go outside. Oh, no. You have to be in an air-conditioned place. Yeah. Like you'll just die. Yeah. From... Exposure. Um, exposure, the heat. Um, also, you can't, you can't sweat. Yeah. Like literally your body can't sweat. Oh, oh, oh. Because it just doesn't work anymore. Oh. Um, we're having a uh, Atari Expo in Santiago, Chile, this upcoming Saturday, largest since 2019. Oh, so it's like a return. Nice. To, oh, that's awesome. That's that's cool. Um, yeah, tell us about it after it's done. Like yeah. On, um, I guess it's next week. Yeah. So after it, yeah, that'd be very interesting yeah. to hear. We've only been to VRGE and PRGE on the west coast we haven't been to any other no i don't think we've traveled anywhere to, to any other conventions. i would like to go to another one at yeah. some point like coordinate with a holiday like i don't know where houston yeah that'd be a cool place yeah there's also austin. a big austin, one in right austin yeah or houston i think there's I one in both remember. yeah um there's one in free play florida there's one in florida as well i'm sure there's a big one in new york i know there's ones in california as yeah. well I'd have to look up where the next biggest one is because I would yeah. want to go to a big one. Like VRG is like almost medium, I would say, or medium size. Medium size. Yeah. That that yeah. It's PRG not is huge. Massive. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's so big. Uh huh. Mm. How big is the one in um, Santiago, Chile, Rod Castler? I don't know how you can compare it, but. In your opinion, 
Um, but yeah, like PRG is just for the arcade games alone, it's worth the ticket. Yeah, yeah. Like even if you don't go to the booths, the talks. Yeah. Just the arcade games and pinballs. Fairly small in the hundreds. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Maybe a thousand like oh, people. Oh, that's found. Yeah. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah, I think so. Like that would be equivalent to the VRGE, I think. Uh, that's pretty. Uh, VRG is a little it's higher than that now. Yeah, but it's yeah. it's again, it's not huge. But... Oh, and I heard PRG yeah. uh, uh, VRG is moving to oh, a bigger location. Really? Yeah. From where it was? Yeah, because they've maxed it out. It's been it in out. the convention center. Yeah. I don't know where. Interesting. Is it like maybe downtown? Could even? be the Vancouver Convention Center, but that would be pretty Ooh, big. They, but they can modularize that. Yeah. Interesting. Uh, that would be very cool. There are lots of hotels too, right? Like it doesn't yeah. have to be like a convention. Hopefully, they don't they don't go too center. big, like they over well estimate. They because they're at a very good location at a very good size right yeah. now, but it does get pretty packed. Yeah. In the morning, it's you can't move almost. Yeah. So I, they could go a slightly bigger, but not too big. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. I'll keep you posted. We may stream live and have some oh, recordings. Oh, that's very cool. Awesome. I'd okay. love to uh, see yeah. what that's like. Um, so we will be back on Tuesday. Yay. Yay. Back for reels. Uh, lots of things to do and see and MGC. unboxing. Oh, yeah. So yeah. much to see. Do You definitely want to be here on Tuesday. MGC. MGC. What is that? What is it? Gaming convention, M Michigan, Minneapolis, uh, Minneapolis, <laughs> uh, Miami, <laughs> Malibu. Uh, I don't know. I have to yeah. type it out. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> uh. So. Um, Midwest. Midwest. Okay. So like I have a big central that. one. Midwest gaming yeah. convention. Okay. Cool. Wisconsin. Yeah. We could go visit. Uh, um uh red letter media <laughs> they are not aware of us <laughs> we are nobodies <laughs> they're a very big channel but oh, that's yeah. where they are yeah right? in wisconsin. yeah in wisconsin yeah um we're canadian maybe they they really like canadians <laughs> we we're, we're not authoritarians on on movies no yeah we love enjoy that, movies love that channel, though. yeah they're yeah. so fun uh, thanks for hanging out. Definitely be on here on Tuesday. We have some fun surprises to announce. Um, yeah, you want to be here. Um, thanks for tuning in. We like Canadians because of you guys. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> thank you, thank Rod you. Kessler. <laughs> uh, thank you, Rod Kessler. Uh, Double Down, uh, Rendered Ghost, Nostalgic, Atari 2600 Dude, Decaf Man 2D, Charles Donnie Mal, uh, Rendered Ghost, uh, Ooh, Teleprompter, thanks you, thank you for treating the cats. They are very happy. Very happy. They were just hanging out, waiting for that. Forty-eight K Ram. Thank you for all the bits. Yes. Uh, for thank encouraging you so much, us. Charles Whelan. We did make it to the patch. Yeah. Um, huge ass. Okay. Uh, anybody at the top? Neo Media. Andrew Davy. Andrew Davy. Thank you, everyone, yes. for cheering us on. And uh, say we'll thank you. definitely say thank you, kitties. Meow, meow, meow. And we'll definitely be doing another After Dark for the Gorf third patch. Yes. Um, because I am somewhat confident, pretty confident. I think you can get there. To get the third patch, I just need to be a little more refreshed again. Yeah. Um, and uh, thank you. Uh, good to see you back. See you in the week. Yes. A couple days. Sunday? Two days. Two days. Yeah. It's already Sunday. Yep. Oh, the weekend goes by so fast. And um, OBS updated their software somewhat recently. So oh, yeah, you were saying The yeah. audio will be not better for you guys, but easier for me to handle. That's that's good. And yeah. definitely easier when we do interviews. Okay. I don't have to mess with things because every time it's like, uh, we can't hear the person on being interviewed because of settings that I have to turn off and then turn back on after. Everything has their own volume now. Oh, that's good. So laptop. The interview is constantly its own thing. That's good. I don't have to touch it. I don't have to do anything. That's, That's good. so good. Excellent. Um, video games are their own volume. The cat treats are their own volume. I can have everything like nice and loud. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. Uh, we're having Rob Yeager joining in video conference for the Expo Ride, by the way. Montezuma's Revenge. Oh, nice. Oh, that's such a good game. Oh, that's so good. Um, 
yeah, hopefully makes a, a new game in the same vein. It's it's a it's an amazing platformer. It's like an, a, such a huge, astounding game for the yes. 2600. I, for scale, I can't think of another game that looks that good and is that big. Yeah. It's so good. Um, Renner Ghost. Yeah, that update made a world of difference for me. Oh, it's it's awesome. I haven't completely set it up, but because I've been doing other stuff. But yeah, I'll be setting it up uh, tomorrow, I guess. Mm -hmm. Getting it all ready. Uh, I can do it bit by bit, but I want to get the cat treats at least wired in properly. Yeah. Yeah. Good stuff. Uh, so thanks everybody uh, for cheering us on, and we will see you uh, in two days on Tuesday. Be sure to tune in. Lots of fun surprises. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So bye everyone. Bye. See you soon. Bye bye.